Here we are down by the Long Meadow, and this is the Carrant Brook uh, within the Carrant catchment area. And it's a fantastic little project that I've been working on alongside John Clark, who's our conservation advisor here, um, who got some funding through the Environment Agency. And they've been fantastic with the resources that they've helped us uh, put together down here to actually re-meander uh, this little stream. So it's got loads of different habitats. Uh, I'm just going to try and pick up a few of those as we go um, along the little brook here. So we've got areas where the water is running faster um, and then we've got some little back eddies. So just up there that was the old um, path of the, of the water. You can see that's been dammed off and that's created a little back eddy there. So some still water. So in times of, um, of uh, higher water flow in the stream, times after floods, before floods, uh, there's a little refuge there for some of the fish just to kind of hide into. And we've got these areas of sort of stone. There's actually a little bit of a ford there so we can get farm machinery um, and people onto the uh, onto the little, almost the little island, if you like, to um, to stream it and maintain it and, and do some weed control and things like that. So this area of stones here, um, this will in time, I think, settle out and potentially be um, a sort of a fish spawning area with any luck. The sides of the bank here are being protected with wicker, uh, locally and naturally sourced um, uh, bits of wood just to help uh, just to help steady up the, this, this bank which has potential to be eroded um, during periods of faster faster water flow. We've got another little sort of backwater, a bit of an eddy there, a bit of some still water, a nice little pond. On the island we've got um, a withy tree or a willow tree that's been pollarded. And um, here we've just got a bit of stone just on the banking, just again to protect those areas that potentially could be prone to erosion. Um, and then we've got another little ford there where that stone is just to, as I say, just to enable us to get machinery in. And this whole area, the water level has been raised and that's created um, some still water just ahead of the re-meandering, if you like, um, to uh, just to create a little bit of depth and a little bit of change in habitat. So uh, it really is a fantastic little inclusion to this bit of the farm, this bit of habitat. We're doing another one just slightly further upstream. So there'll be two of these um, and uh, it really is a great bit of conservation work and hopefully we'll be able to improve the habitat for some fish and, uh, and bits and pieces in the in the current brook here. So um, that's what we've been doing and uh, yeah, maybe come back in a year or two to see how, um, how things have changed.